With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hi everyone, let's take a question. So here the question is draw the structure of the following molecule or ion. So here we have is IF3. Okay, so here if we talk about the IF3, first we will find out the hybridization. Okay. So here first when we need to find out the hybridization, hybridization is the mixing of the atomic orbitals. It tells us about that which atomic orbitals are mixed together to form a new orbital. Okay, mixing of the atomic orbitals, mixing of the atomic orbitals. Okay, so now here when we have the IF3 molecule, so here in the IF3, I belongs to the halogen family and it is our central atom. It is our central atom and it belongs to the halogen family. Okay, it belongs to the halogen family having the seven valence electrons, right? It has the seven valence electrons. So to find the hybridization, we have one formula that is X here. The X is our number of the hybrid orbitals. Okay, so here this number of hybrid orbital is, is equal to 1.2 here we have valence electron plus monovalent atom minus charge on cation plus charge on anion okay this is valence electron monovalent atoms charge on cation charge on anion okay so now here the valence electrons in the if3 in the central atom is 7 plus monovalent atoms are attached 3 minus 0 plus 0 here we get is 5. Here we get is 5. And when the number of hybrid orbitals are 5, then the hybridization is sp3d. Okay, hybridization is sp3d. Now it has the 7 electrons that are valence. Okay, it is having the 7 valence electrons. Okay, so here now if we see its stru structure, so it will be like this. Here we have the I. Here we will have the two lone pairs because it will form the two bond pairs with the three bond pair with the fluorine. Okay, here we have fluorine, here we have the fluorine and here we have the fluorine. Okay, its representation is like this. Okay, so this is the representation. Okay, so here what we can say is it is the representation that is the T-shaped. It is which representation? T-shaped representation. Okay. So here, if we want to represent it clearly, so here, this is the structure. Here we have iodine, here we have the fluorine and here we have is the fluorine and here we have the fluorine because it has formed the three bond pairs. Okay. And the two will be the lone pairs. Two will be the lone pairs and three is the bond pairs and it is our T shape or we can say the seesaw representation. Okay. So this is the structure. Having two lone pairs and three bond pairs. Two lone pair, three bond pair. Okay, so this is our required structure. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.